Oh, where am I looking? Right there. And you're looking right in the camera lens. Right there. All right. How, How are we, we gonna open this? it? <laughs> hey, everybody! Welcome back to my channel. Okay, I need to get serious. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's do this. Everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited because I have my friend. This is Platinum Premiere number nine. Nine. Angela Gunter. Yay! Hello, so, everybody. Um, when did I meet you? I actually met Angela two years ago. Sure, sounds perfect. Two years ago, in person at a day away, and I introduced myself because I was impressed with Angela's business prowess and her um, presence on the different Facebook groups that there are for posh consultants. So I introduced myself to her and we became fast friends. Yay, over Big Brother. <laughs> we did watch Big Brother finale we together. We're both from New York State, so there's a fun fact for you. And we met through posh. Upstate New York too. Upstate New York. Yes. And that's further than Orange County. <laughs> Anything not the city. Yes, correct. Like basically almost the Canadian border. Right? True. So um, she's actually been spending this week at my house with me. We were in Hawaii last week and we're going to be in Vegas next week. So hello. We thought we would spend a friend week. It's been interesting. <laughs> <laughs> we did lots of fun stuff. We did. We yeah. went and got my hair done because everybody laughed at my grace. So I, Jessica I took laugh. care of me. I didn't laugh at her grace. Um, what else did we do? Um, we spent some time on the couch. Couch. The couch has been wonderful. <laughs> if some of you don't know, I live in an RV. Full time. So that couch, yeah, I don't get that in my RV. It's luxury. It's luxury. <laughs> we worked our businesses. Yes, we did. And um, at one point we were doing a training with our teams and we got a bunch of like, what's it like to be a Platinum Premier questions? And so I thought, let's put them together in a little list and make a video. Do you have the list? I sure do. In my trusty dusty notebook. Why is it dusty? Oh, never mind. <laughs> you guys, she's, she, is, she is really mean to me. Oh my God. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. No. Oh, here's a funny story. So all week I've been calling her my mom and she doesn't like that because she's not old enough to be my mom. Kind of, but not really. So I told her she's like my big sister. That's just like mom. <laughs> so she's my big sister that's just like mom. <laughs> you make me cry. Stop. Okay. It's almost my birthday. Okay. okay. okay so <laughs> where did that come from? Oh my God. All right. So the first question, what did you get? How long did it take you to become a platinum premier? It took me forever. Yeah. But you didn't did. quit? No, I did not quit because I knew the end result was going to be amazing, so I had to keep going. Um, I did direct sales before, so I kind of consider that part of getting to Platinum. I learned a lot nine years before I came to Posh. And then I incorporated that all, and then it took me another three years in Posh to make it to Platinum. So three years in Posh. In Posh, yes. I mean, three years seems like not a very long time anyway. No, maybe not for some. But we're overachievers. Right. So how long did it take you, Jessica Posh? Well, I was a little fast about it. I basically put my life on hold and went all in, like, whoa. And it took me 18 months to get to Platinum, which I actually don't recommend. I feel like that was almost too fast. Eh, you did it. it but I did it, and it was worth it. It was worth <laughs> it. Now we can go on trips together. It's true. True. Oh, P.S. We were just in Hawaii last week, if you didn't already see my haul video, and that was for our Platinum Premiere Retreat. So every year, Posh takes the Platinums to a different exotic location. Mm -hmm. I want to go back to Hawaii. I want to go back to Hawaii, Let's too. go. It was the best, you guys. Hawaii is seriously the best. The best. Like, best climate, best... Mm, and our faces all look just beautiful, yes. and our skin was beautiful and dewy. And the ocean is probably oh. nice. Okay, let's not talk about it anymore. <laughs> Next question! <laughs> okay. So in your quest to become a Platinum Premier, Angela, what was your biggest struggle? Um, I think my biggest struggle was this right here. Um, I never felt like I was good enough to make it to the top, and so that I had to just sit myself down and have that conversation like, hey, 
you are good enough you work super hard you deserve all of this you deserve the cash you deserve the trips and your family deserves to be happy and live comfortably and so finally i got in my head that i was good enough and it happened we keep getting dark and i'm going to kill somebody can we maybe move up a little closer i can zoom us out there we go now get closer come closer <laughs> she's a creep <laughs> So um, my biggest struggle, I would say, is similar. It was right in my head, and it was really about getting started. I kind of had a negative connotation in my mind about direct sales. I didn't want to be a direct seller. I didn't want to sure. put myself out there like that, and I was worried about being embarrassed when I was, hey, guys, I'm selling soap and lotion. I didn't want to be ridiculed or laughed at or really put myself out there at all. So that was really my biggest struggle was getting started. Once I got started... And I started to experience the posh life. It was easy the from there. I mean, kind of took off. more simple than easy. <laughs> but it was simple. It was a lot more simple to push myself and to really keep going because I saw the potential. All right, next question. How much time do you spend working on your business? Hmm, I will be completely honest. I do believe that I spent a lot more time getting here than I am here. Um, For sure. I would say I spent a good... I want to say 60 hours before platinum and now I'm probably at 30 hours a week. What about you? Similar. I spent <clears throat> far too many, but it was all worth it. Right. Lots of hours, probably 60 hours or more a week working my business. Um, once I decided to do posh full time, I poshed around the clock on holidays, on the weekends. Yeah. But I knew it was to arrive here. And now that uh, ever since I've hit platinum, Gosh, my work week has really been reduced down to probably 20 to 30 hours a week, depending on the week. Like the first week of the month, the last week of the month, I work a little bit more. And then the middle of the month, I play a little bit more. Well, and I think that people nowadays, they forgotten what that word sacrifice means. Like I had to sacrifice a lot of time with the children, but I was always there. So if something did happen, I could help them or my husband or when he came home from a deployment I was always there but yet I did sacrifice some of the time away from them so I mean it's just it's what you want it's just everybody has to sacrifice to get what they want if they want something right and I think it's a misconception like a lot of people think once you reach the top once you're a platinum premier once you're at the top of any other direct sales company you kind of just get to, to sit back and relax and yeah, you do get to sit back a little bit and you get to go to Hawaii and all of this fun stuff, but you've still got to work your business. There's still a personal business that we have to work every single day, not to mention the team and company that we feel responsible for leading. Very true. But that said, there are days when I'm kind of complaining. I don't know why I put that in quotes because I definitely do <laughs> complain. There are days when I'm complaining about having to do work or having to make graphics or having to do something. But you guys, I'm literally sitting on the couch in my pajamas. Right. At home. Can't beat it. So uh, the sacrifice was definitely worth it. Huge. 100%. Yeah. Ooh, this is a good one. I can't wait to hear your answer. What's the most money you've ever made in one month? What was your biggest mm. check ever? I believe it was last year at this time. And my regular check, I would say 26,000, 26,000 in one month. Pretty awesome. Platinum goals. Right? <laughs> the biggest check I ever had was earlier this year. I think it was June. I might be making that part up. Earlier this year, 16,000. Nice. I not couldn't believe shout. it. That's not happening every month, guys. I don't want to <clears throat> put false hopes into your brains, but we make a lot of money. If you work it right, right? <laughs> yeah, and it's it's totally worth it. It's worth the sacrifices. It's easy for me to look back and think, I gave up so much, but I gave up so much for such a short amount of time. Really, I mean, 18 months, two years, whatever. She worked it for three years. How many years do you have to spend in corporate America right. to achieve? You can't. You can't. You can't. There's no way. Because that person above you is making all the money. Mm -hmm. so. I've always been drawn to like sales positions where you're 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 in charge of yeah. what you make it, the sky is the limit <laughs> so true okay last question what was your proudest moment um i would say when okay so for platinum premiere we have to have four premieres 
below us. So it was like when I saw all of my platinums coming together, all four of them, and we accomplished platinum, I think that was huge because they wanted it as bad as I did. And it was a whole team effort and you can't get here without your team being all in. So I think, I think that was my biggest, yeah. How about you? I don't know. So many proud moments. Pasha's really been like a, a big part of my life the last couple of years and I've had a lot of really like gut check moments. Like I can't believe this is my life. I can't believe it's happening. If I had to pick one, I think probably the first time that I did a training on stage for like my posh sisters to be recognized as somebody that not only my team or my customers want to hear from, but like my, my equals, my posh sisters wanted to hear from little old me. Like that was really, I remember that day. Oh, that was a big deal. And it was, it was a lot of pressure, but mm. you get used to it. <laughs> now I just do it in my sleep. Do it. Fine. <laughs> it's good stuff. Um, so overall, we love being platinum premieres and we love our <laughs> platinum premiere sisters because mm -hmm. there's about 25 of us now and it's just a great group of girls and we are looking forward to growing that so yeah get then, to platinum the next out uh, platinum retreat we don't know where it's mm -hmm. going to be yet but mm -hmm. it would be pretty awesome if we could see that number like double right 50. and i'm just gonna throw it out there because i really can't make a video without throwing it out there Posh is really just getting started, guys. True. We've been, we just turned six years old. We just got a brand new website. We've gone through growing pains and hiccups here and there, but literally we're just getting started. There's like less than 100,000 active right. consultants nationwide. Look at these other big direct sales companies that have been around. They have millions, millions. of consultants. So if you're watching this and you've never heard of Posh, Hello, contact one of us. We will tell you all about it. Poshmehappy.com. <laughs> JessicaPosh.com. <laughs> and if you're watching this and you are a new Posh consultant, girl, the sky is literally the limit. Like, don't hold back. Seriously, there's so much potential. You can go from protege to platinum premiere in 18 months. You can go that way in five years. No matter what, the path is set. Like, there's opportunity right now it's crazy and our products are amazing i don't want to say they sell themselves because you have to get out there and work it but once you get that product on people bam it's out there and people want it so. yeah when i make a sale like i don't get somebody calling me back two weeks later to reorder because hello our products last forever right. but they call me back two weeks later and they're like uh so what else you got yeah <laughs> true it's like Very gateway true. yeah awesome. it's good stuff but anyway, thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you for being a guest on my channel. Thank you for interviewing me. <laughs> it was like twisting her arm, you guys. Yeah, I'm not a video girl. Hmm. It's okay. And I just can't help it. My video voice just comes on as soon as the camera's on. I'm ready to party. Are we done? <laughs> oh my God. Um, yeah, we can be done. Okay. How do you want to sign off? Um, I don't know. No, not that. <laughs> I'm just going to sit here and be pretty. You be the oh, talent. Sure. Sure. The <laughs> I don't have any talent. I'm just me. Okay, are we done? We're huh? done. Bye! Thanks for watching! Lots of cooking. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> All right, what are you doing? Okay. You need to stand a little closer. You need to stand up here. There you go. <laughs> and wait. Oh, what's going on? Why are we? Why are we oh. dark? Hello. Oh. All week I've been. Oh, why are we dark? Hello. Come back to us, light. That's better. Why are we dark again? Get it together, lighting. Lord. Okay, I'm break. <laughs> Why are dark again? It's your fault. Every time you step out of frame, we get dark. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll cut that part out. 
never even happened. Oh my god, this is gonna be like an hour long and you're gonna have to try to edit it. Oh my god, <laughs> it's the worst. What? Does that not hurt? What? Is it crooked? No. Your fingernail in my eye is gonna hurt. Huh? <gasps> was that it was attached? In your eye. No, it was in your eye. I'm gonna put that in. I'm putting that in the video. Are you recording? Yeah. You are recording. <laughs> you didn't tell me that. Duh.